good day, right? In the house of the Lord. I want to share with you uh, from Luke's Gospel, the uh, fifth chapter, and begin at uh, verse 12. Uh, <clears throat> while Jesus was uh, in uh, one of the towns, a man came along who, had, uh, who was covered with leprosy. When he saw Jesus, he fell with his face to the ground and begged him, Lord, uh, if you are willing, uh, you can make me clean. Jesus reached out his hand and touched the man. I am willing, he said, be clean. And immediately the leprosy uh, left him. Then Jesus uh, ordered him, don't tell anyone, but go show yourself to the priest and offer the sacrifices that Moses commanded uh, for your cleansing uh, as a testimony to them. Yet the news about him spread all the more. So the crowds of people came to hear him uh, and he healed uh, and be healed of their sicknesses. But Jesus uh, often withdrew uh, to lonely places uh, and prayed. Uh, that was something that Jesus did very often. Sometimes he went, uh, would go out in the night and all night he would be in prayer uh, unto his uh, uh, Father in heaven. Uh, <clears throat> but as I was uh, uh, read, reading this uh, uh, passage uh, uh, this 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 morning uh, before coming uh, over here across the border, uh, it, uh, it it came to my mind that uh, that uh, leprosy was supposed to uh, be shouting uh, unclean, unclean, to let everybody know that they should not come near him or or to touch him because. Uh, uh, because uh, uh, this uh, leprosy uh, was something that could uh, uh, could uh, come upon the, the person that, that would do so. Uh, and uh, here, though, it says that uh, that uh, that uh, he uh, this uh, a leper bowed down, uh, and uh, Jesus did something then that he wasn't supposed to do. He touched uh, this man. And uh, it, it made me wonder about myself, and maybe maybe it would cause you to wonder as well. That uh, what if uh, someone were to come uh, who was of this kind of uh, of sort? Maybe maybe not uh, uh, dressed very clean, or uh, maybe having a, a raggedy clothes. What 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 do we do we do uh, with uh, such a person if they were to walk uh, into? into our assembly here. And uh, I'm thinking that I, we, I wish, I hope, that I would be one who would be willing uh, uh, to, to touch that person. And uh, in the same way, uh, perhaps you would think that same way. Uh, uh, if, if, if not, well, uh, then uh, we need to look a little bit more at Jesus' example. Jesus touched him and he was made whole. Jesus did something good for him. Uh, and if there's a person that needs somebody to touch them, the Lord wants to use you and he wants to use me to touch those, uh, those individuals. There are a couple of uh, people that, uh, that we, we know. Uh, <clears throat> uh, one's name is Brian and he's in the hospital. And the other one is, uh, is a, a young uh, person named Liam, if I said that correctly, is that? Liam. 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 And, uh, and uh, both of these uh, would, would covet our, our prayers this morning and, and actually uh, have asked that we would remember them uh, in prayer. Are there any other prayer requests? For people that will, or, or prayer requests that you would like to make known at this time this morning. Yeah, my nephew Gary can't be here tomorrow, and we just pray that everything that will be for him and that they get the surgery very soon. So, uh, I, 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 I'm probably going to have trouble remembering his name. Gary, did you say? Gary, and uh, we'll remember him in prayer. 
as well. Okay, our gracious guest. Also, I won't mention a name, someone also possibly uh, needing surgery for a heart valve, but the Lord knows. Okay, a person that may, may need to have a heart, a heart valve. Either is terrible, is terrible. Either, either is still yeah. sick, and, and actually the whole uh, uh, Kotital is uh, fighting the flu today, so let's remember them in, in prayer. So let's bow our hearts before the Lord in prayer this morning. Our gracious Heavenly Father, we, we're thankful and grateful that we can come into your house, Lord God, and we thank you for the health that you've given unto us, and, and, and we glorify you and honor you, Lord, in our singing, and, uh, and Lord, in our worship of you, and, and we just praise your name, and we also, Lord, want to remember those, Lord God, who, who cannot be among us, Lord, because uh, for one reason or another, and, and for these names that were mentioned, Lord, uh, uh, Brian in the hospital, Lord God, uh, touch him, Lord God, uh, we pray. Uh, uh, we pray for healing, Lord God, for him. Uh, and uh, Lord, if uh, you, you want him to go beyond uh, somewhere else, Lord, uh, well, you, you, we know that you will be with him, Lord, to, to touch uh, uh, his life. And Liam, Lord God, we pray, uh, uh, Lord, uh, for your uh, touch upon his life as well, uh, that things will go well with him as he uh, as they uh, try to determine, Lord, uh, what is his, uh, uh, what is uh, causing his high temperature. Lord, we pray that you will touch him, Lord, and, and uh, be with the family, Lord God. We, we pray and we glorify you. Uh, <clears throat> Uh, you and uh, and uh, Iris, Lord God, who's uh, in the, in the uh, finished rest home, uh, we we pray for that whole home where there are many, Lord God, who are suffering from the flu. We ask, Lord God, for your your touch, Lord God, quicken their bodies, Lord God, to fight uh, back against the flu, and we give you the glory and the honor and praise. And this one, Lord, that uh, possibly is going to have. Uh, as surgery, Lord God, on their heart. We pray for them as well. We lift them up before you, Lord God. Uh, we know uh, that you are a God of miracles. Uh, and uh, Lord, we look uh, to hear uh, wonderful uh, testimonies, Lord God, uh, of what you have done, uh, for you are good. And Lord, remember Gary in, in, his, in our prayer, Lord God, before the, the throne of grace. Uh, Glory and honor and praise belong unto thy name. Lord, we pray that you would minister to our hearts today as we are gathered here and that you would bless your word. Lord, uh, uh, as we as we listen to it as well today, bless Lord God, Bob, as he, as he brings it forth, Lord God. Hallelujah. Blessed be your name. Uh, be glorified in all of what you do and accomplish. Uh, in Jesus' name we pray. Amen.